Good afternoon. Happy Monday. It's Matt the Mortgage Guy here with Mortgage Mondays, Episode 5. Well, I'll be talking the all-important debt-to-income and how you calculate those ratios. Matt the Mortgage Guy here. Mortgage Mondays, Episode 5, where I'm talking debt-to-income. And if you've talked to someone recently about getting a mortgage and you've heard the term debt to income, DTI, um, what it's referring to is your debt to income ratio. And for all intents and purposes, if you're looking for a conventional um, loan, you're going to want your debt to income ratio to be at or below 45%. What that means, we'll use real numbers so you get an idea. Let's say your monthly gross income is $5,000. You times that by 45%, 2250 is the maximum amount you can have in in total debt, including a new mortgage. So let's say you've got um, a car payment of $275 a month, you've got a student loan of $125 a month, you've also got a credit card with a monthly minimum payment of $50 a month. That $450 plus a new mortgage, let's call the new mortgage $1,800 a month, that $2,250 a month is your maximum debt. And that debt to income ratio is 45%. That's the gist of it. If you got any questions regarding debt to income, feel free to reach out. MattTheMortgageGuy.com, 916-529-7600. Have a good Monday. Talk to you soon.